<laughs> uh, look what I got, look who did Young nigga, I told you that I'm gonna be big And I ain't gonna stop It's just gonna keep on happening I'm just gonna keep on What's going on, people? It's your boy Levi, man I'm back in the building I see what time it is, bro I had to make one of these videos, bro I had some I had plans on doing some other videos I still got those planned, but People would hit me up in my DMs Oh, shit People was hit me up in my DMs People was hit me up in my DMs About this guy, Joe Easy And they were saying, bro You reacted to this guy And they were saying exactly what he did Supposedly he's arrested for the death of his his uh, brother. I, didn't they say his brother, his mom, and the dad? Like, what the fuck you got going on? Somebody said mental. Um, I'm not for sure. I don't know. I had to go back to the. I had, I was looking. I was like, because at first I didn't see no video of me reacting to him, and then somebody uh commented on it. Like really, they literally commented on it recently, so I just seen it. Then somebody sent it to me in my DM, so. I was like, oh shit, I did react to him. But uh yeah man, we about to uh get into this video. Hopefully it could give us a little more details of what's going on here. Who's bro shit? Rock boy ninja. Shout out to Rock Boy Ninja. Hey, what's the update? What's what's what the hell's going on? What's good, YouTube? Back with another one. Before we get into it, make sure you guys hit that like, hit that subscribe, hit that notification bell. But let's get right into it. Now, according to reports, Regent Park rapper Joe Easy had a mental breakdown and ended up taking the life of his brother, his father, and giving his mama legos. Now, officers from Fifth. Go shoot your mom, shoot your brother. Kill both of them. So, I, I, I guess that he just shot him in the head, then shoot your mom in the leg, give your mama legos? Damn, man, I wish he would have just gave all of them a legacy. They would have still been here. But this, oh, my God, what the f***? The one division responded to Dundas Street East, just east of Parliament Street at around 1.30 p.m. for reports of the south. Not even he should have gave them all a legacy, bro. Why you ain't just shoot your damn self, nigga? Why you, if you're going to crash out, bro, don't put nobody into your crashing out. If you're going to go slide on your ops, ops, they got issues with you too, hey. But just innocent people that ain't got nothing to do with your mental illness, bro. Like, niggas, like, y'all got to be careful you all hang around, man. If you hanging around somebody who got mental illness and you know, like, they ain't all the way rap type, bro, don't be hanging around their ass, bro. <laughs> Straight up. I know you want to be a good friend. Don't hang around them motherfuckers. Bro. ...of gunshots. When officers arrived, they found two men and a woman suffering from gunshot wounds. Police said one of the men was pronounced dead at the scene, while the other man died from his injuries in the hospital. The woman was rushed to the hospital with non-life-threatening injuries, and police said she would be released soon. Now, there's a video going around of a person that's allegedly Joe Easy chasing down his brother in broad daylight. Does that sound like a person that's mentally stable to you? Let's be honest, man. When it happens in the white neighborhood, what's the first thing they always say? Oh, mental illness, this, mental health that but what about the black community man what about the hood we see it all the time a lot of these young guys 14 15 16 they end up catching some case for some dumb ish some things that they don't even deserve jail time for but because they don't have the family support they end up doing a little meet a little five six months bid and when they get out you could tell they're not the same person they was when they went in man i'm not saying this is the case in that situation i'm just saying i don't think he was mentally there i don't know one person from the hood that's gonna point a, a stick at their mom in my personal opinion i could be wrong like i said i've been wrong Bro, you point stick at your mom, nigga. You a fucking goofy. This nigga Joe Easy, bro. You are officially a fucking goofy, nigga. Like, who does shit like this? Hmm. This is this is some crazy shit. Good thing the mom is alive to explain what happened, or cause bro ain't explaining exactly what happened. Like, what made what made him do this shit? Cause right now he's just looking like a fucking goofy. Like who who does shit like this, nigga? Like <laughs> if something happens to him, like ain't nobody gonna worry about this nigga, bro. Like, come on, bro. What what was that for? I feel like until we get the explanation, nigga, like you're a fucking L, nigga. Like before man there was also two police officers injured in the foot chase trying to catch this guy, one of them in the arm, one of them in the leg, not sure if they got hit. So let me get this straight. You shoot your peoples. But you running from the police. Why you ain't shoot at the police? Come on, man. Like, you on some... You gang gang. You gangster, right? Shoot at the police, bro. 
If you're gonna crash out, go ahead and shoot that police so they can just go ahead and blow you down. Like, this shit is crazy, bro. Like, none of that shit is necessary, bro. Like, I don't know, because it just reminds me of the dude Wasa. Wasa, I remember back then when I was really was on the um, Toronto scene, he was reacting to videos and things was going on. Like, I ended up running into the uh, the Wasa guy in the videos, and people were telling me about him. Then I started seeing videos, and then you come to find out, bro, was. What, he was in an alley or a driveway or something, and he started shooting at the police, and they shot him down. Like, why are you shooting at the police, bro? Like, what are you? What? But it's like, I don't know, man. Maybe dudes out here really do have mental, but to be killing your family, bro, come on, man. Where they just injured themselves trying to catch him. There was a firearm recovered at the scene. So he's going to be charged with first degree murder, a bunch of attempt murder charge and whatnot, man. Unfortunate situation, but the real victim right now is his mom, man. She lost three people in one day. She lost her husband and her two sons. One of them to the system, one of them to the grave, man. So she's really going to be going through it right now. But like I said, man, mental health in the hood goes undiagnosed a lot of times, man. A lot of people just live like it's normal. And there's a lot of serial killers running around in the hood if you think about it man but y'all can let me know your thoughts in the comment section what do you guys think about this whole joe easy situation like i said me personally man i don't think he was all there doesn't make sense for him to throw it all away when you see him on the gram he's always posting his music even though his music is not good he's always in the latest designer drip <laughs> bro say even though his music is not that great he's in the latest dripping designer and that's the thing like niggas got all this dripping designer but at the end of the day, you still fucking feel shitty because your music ain't doing shit. Like, yeah, you in the latest designer, but how? Your music ain't popping. So it's like, niggas be on the 50th floor and all in the in a nice little penthouse. Yeah, we get into the bag. Mental illness. Real bro really hurt because he ain't getting no views. Bro ain't getting no traction. Um, I don't know what it could be, man. This is like that mental illness shit, man. I feel like a lot of dudes just be making up excuses and shit like posted up in fancy rental cars so i don't see why a young man like this would throw it all away if he's mentally there that's just my those flashy rentals bro that's why these dudes rolling like this personal opinion once again y'all can let me know your thoughts in the comment section hit that like hit that share hit that subscribe button follow me on twitch follow me on instagram rock boy ninja link in the description box you don't know you don't know bro i wonder what his homies think it is because his homies like what what do they think of this? They they think that shit cool. <laughs> that shit wild, man. Joe Easy. Joe Easy, man. I don't really know what to say about the dude, man. RB to the to the people that lost their lives, man. That was not necessary at all. Y'all know what time it is. Come on, man. We ain't we ain't gotta say nothing else. See y'all next video. Peace.